Hi and welcome back to new mixed media tutorial. Today I'm sharing a mixed media tag with a lot of layers and texture. I'm using a tag that is already printed with the jelly plate and I have also added some white gesso to it. And now I'm using an old tea bag and tear it apart and I will glue it down with gel medium. The thin material of the tea bag adds a nice texture to the tag and also some shadings. What I now add is some tissue and that's colored with brush or powders. This is perfect for collaging. I also decided to add some paper napkin. I'm using a mask from Stamplerations, these are the negative parts of a stencil, to create some texture by adding gesso with a sponge. I also add some gesso with my fingers because I like a lot of white space. I add in some color with the Neo Color Crayons. These are water soluble and you can also perfectly use the scribble sticks. I'm applying more gesso with the palette knife. I use some oil pastels to add more color. The oil pastels also add a little bit of a grungy feel to the tag. I picked the rubber dance carved whimsy wood stamps. These are uh, rubber stamps but they look like handcraft stamps. And I ink the mushroom up with a neocolor crayon, spritz it with, with water and stamp it to the tag. You can also use the scribble sticks for this technique.
I also use some of the leaves that come with the set to add more interest. You will find a free shipping code to the Rubber Dance webshop in the description box. I'm stamping my sentiment that also comes from rubber dance onto a piece of tissue paper and I will glue it down with gel medium. This is a good way to make sure that you get a good impression of your stamp on your work. I use a piece of black cardstock to frame my tag. For that I glue it down and cut it out just a little bit bigger than the original size. Thank you so much for watching today, I hope you enjoyed the video, so please give me a thumb up and subscribe to my channel. Bye!